going on? Day number two out on the res. So yesterday, Alex and I came out and we fished down lake and he smoked two fish on a jerk bait right at the end of the day, probably like the last 20 minutes of fishing. Check those out. Yeah. yeah. Jerk bait? Yes, we got one. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Keep oh her. My god. Take your time, take your time, take your time, take your time. <laughs> In there. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, baby. I don't have a scale. Look at that. Jerk bait. Jerk bait. Jerk bait. Now we're back out here. We're up Opposite lake. End. Opposite end. It's way cleaner. Yes. Yeah. And Four feet visibility possible. How long do you think we have before the snow? Like five or six hours? Yeah, it's gonna start coming in in the early afternoon. Three, four o'clock. Hopefully that turns the fish on. But we've got some jerk baits, Alabama rig, Ned rig, and cold water. 38.3. Yeah, big difference from yesterday. It's five degrees a little colder. Let's go. So in about half miles distance, water temperature dropped two degrees. It's 36.5 right here. So we just ran through like a ton of ice, really thin layer on the surface, but we're gonna look around for some bait. Bait. Three or four feet of visibility up here. That's nice. That's from All right. Well, we're gonna try to keep the ice off our guides and throw an underspin. 4.8 inch Kitek, and I think this is a fish heads underspin, 3 eighths ounce. Yeah. Alex and I did a little bit of graphing just to see what's going on around here, and there's like quite a few really massive schools of bait around. Fish? Fish. fish. Nice! Silver buddy fish. Dude, that's a good fish, too. Looks like he's staying down. Be big. Be big. Is that a cat? Oh, you caught a big... <laughs> oh, welcome to the rest. Come on, come on. Cat daddy was hungry today. He ate it? I thought I snagged him. I thought you snagged him, too. No, he ate it. Look at him. He was oh. down in the mud. Perfect. How's that feel? Awful. <laughs> I thought I had a giant. There's a fish. Got him. Yeah. Jerk bait. It's a winter fish. It's another cat. Oh no, that's a good bass. It's real solid. Is that a smallmouth? No. Oh my god, I would freak out. It'd be huge. It is, dude. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Oh my god, my first big smallmouth here. Dude, that is nice. I've never caught a smallmouth here. Look how pale he is, too. That's what, that's what fooled me. I was like, there's yeah. no way. It's so yeah. pale. His, like 20 minutes in, Alex just picked up this nice smallmouth. What did he go? Three, two, six. Oh, yeah. Same jerkbait as yesterday. Uh, yeah. Check that beauty out. Sega? Hell yeah! <laughs> yes! Oh my god. Smallmouth are pretty rare out here. You don't really catch too many. So that's pretty awesome. I need to throw a jerk bait. Well, that's a good way to start the day off. The catfish, I mean. <laughs> it's a little dirty, but it'll work. It's a pointer 100 deep diver. It's got that extra long lip. This is what Alex, well not this exact bait, but he was catching his fish on a deep diving, what was it, Rapala? Yeah. Another one? Yeah, that's a good one too. Oh my oh, god. No, I gotta go. I gotta... Dude, they are crushing that jerk bait. Dude, he's not coming off. Is it? Is <laughs> it? Did he crush? It. It's down. His mouth is wide open. Oh no, he didn't. never mind. He doesn't have eh. a Come here, baby. Get up in there. <laughs> Yes, dude. Ah. You're an animal. Yes. You're uh. killing it. 
Dude. Jerkbait I'm, season, I'm baby. A jerkbait, man. It does all the work for me. Four? Four eighteen. Yeah. Dude, that fish yesterday was definitely six. Oh, 100% <laughs> six pounder, yeah. It made that one look like a two pounder. <laughs> it's the Alex show today. Got gills. Has got gills. So we ran back to the truck real quick and Alex grabbed his jerkbait box because he <laughs> threw his other one off. So he's giving me one of these shadow wraps to throw. This is a little bit different color. Orange belly, bright white on top. I'm gonna tie this on, <laughs> throw it around a little bit. Cut, ooh, fish. Nice. Good one. Oh yeah. Dude, the fucking giant fest out here right now. That one's really hooked. <laughs> oh, yes. Another pig. Another Oh, he's five. He's a five pounder. Dude, you are just on a roll right now. Yeah, five pounder. So that brings us up to what we got. See you later, big girl. Four and a four pounder, five, that's nine, and then 12 and a quarter basically yeah for, for three, three fish. fish and then yesterday with six and uh basically nine pounds be 21 and a quarter with five so sick well i haven't joined the fish catching party yet alex is just hogging them all all these fish are really really good that one was suspended way out i mean was he he was pretty close to the boat when he hit it and we're in 25 feet right here and we haven't moved much yeah that's true he was right next to the boat yeah. but that's Three solid fish, three pound smallmouth, four four pound largemouth, and a five pound largemouth all on that jerk bait. I need to get one. It's so cold out here, my big camera battery it like immediately died. <laughs> my second one is like gonna die too. So I'm holding that off for the uh, the eight pounder we're gonna yeah. catch. It seems like every one of those fish has come off of the exact same spot. Yeah. There must be like a school of fish holding up to some sort of structure change down there, whether it's like a little drop off or point. After sitting here for all day. It's really cool though. It was on the pause again. I mean, I kind of was just, it was slack line. As I jerked into it, I felt that weight and then just kind of gave it the, the double hammer there. And it looked like it came up a few feet. There it is. Another one, next cast. Now you're stuck. You want me to get the marker buoy and try to knock it? This should definitely do the trick. It's a quick tip for you guys. If you don't have a lure knocker, just use your buoy marker. Send it. This should work. Almost positive. Fishing for the fish catching jerk bait. Just hold it tight real quick. Got it. There you go. It works sometimes. Now it's time for a big fish. There you go. Quick lure retriever slash fish marker. Multi-purpose. Got it. Works again. You got a fish. You got one. What the hell? You had one. Is he on there? Oh, he's on there. Look at that. Silver buddy fish, smallest one in two days, and it's still probably a keeper, pound and a half. <laughs> nice. I might have to throw. Dude, I <laughs> look how white he is. He he's cold. Might have to steal a silver buddy from you. I got one. Go with the monster. One. There's another fish. Another one? Yep. Oh my god, dude! Give me a silver buddy. <laughs> is that a good is that one? A better fish? I think that's a good fish. It, yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. Very next cast, he hooks into another one on the silver, buddy. No! <laughs> well, you never know till you see it. Winter bass are kind of weird sometimes. Oh, it's a that's bass! A bass. It's, a better, it's a bass! It's a bass! Choop! 
<laughs> Dude, you are on fire. That's a, another two and a half, three pounder. Probably two and a half. Solid fish though, dude. See ya. But I'm gonna have to steal one of your silver buddies. You just went back to back right when you switched up baits too. That was great. Another one? Yep. Are you kidding me? It's another decent one, dude. Are you serious dude, right now? It's another good one. Three casts in a row with the silver buddy. You know what's gonna happen? I'm gonna put it on and <laughs> the bite's gonna turn off. Oh yeah, he's not, is that another smallie? No. No, it's large. Ah. All right, here, you take care of that fish while I tie up. <laughs> Let me have one. I'm just vertical jigging this thing. Like I know it's in their face. They just, they know it's me. Oh, I got one. Yes. I got a fish. <laughs> yeah. Feels really small. <laughs> That's a bass. Hey. Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, I'll take it. All that hard work, and I finally got one in the snow. Look at that, it's like purpley. Yeah, it does have that purple kind of tint to its back. Yes, I didn't get skunked. That's cool. Yeah, the floodgates are open now. Game time, now that I got that out of the way. So that fish that I just caught, and the last three that Alex caught, were right down from the point we were fishing where Alex was catching the fish on the jerk bait. This is just like a pretty solid bluff wall that drops off into a channel. There's a ton of bait. Saw some bigger marks too. How I managed to catch a fish that small after you've been catching threes, fours, and fives all day? I'll never know. Is that one? Yeah, it's not bad. Jerk bait. Jerk bait's back. Pounder. Yeah, look at the way he took that too. Alex's seventh fish of the day. Oh. Fish! Crappy! I know it's a bass. <laughs> I'm the king of dinks, I guess. I was actually letting it sit down there. But he picked it up while I was just... Just on the bottom, yep. That last jerkbait fish was probably about the same... It was probably about the same spot, yeah. Dink. But it was fish number two. Yeah, nine fish so far. Fucking January. January, baby. 40 degree water. Your uh, seven fish bag is only a little bit bigger than my two fish bag. I think I might have. Power bag. I might have two pounds. Got him. Now it's smallin'. Crappie. crappie! That's what I was looking for. It's a little baby crappie too. Multi-species, smallmouth, largemouth crappie. Catfish, four species yeah. today. Fish. Ew! Oh, it feels good. Nah, he's not, he's not big. <laughs> it's a big, it's a big old crappie crop. Not bad. I'll take him. It's funny, he hit it and was just running right at the boat. So I thought he was big at first, and I was wrong. They have good surface area. Not a bad crappie. See ya. Oh, look at that fish coming down from my bait. Dude, clear as day. That was clear as day. Got him. Oh my god, what good one. <laughs> Yeah, that's a better fish. Oh, this no. might be a cat. It's a cat. I think. If, yeah, this is a freaking catfish. I believe. Yep. Kitty. Dang it. Uh, unroll yourself, friend. All right, let me snag some. You got some pliers? All I need is two seconds of your time. See ya. All right. Now let's go catch his uh, cousin, Mr. Bass. I'm a For a second, I thought it was gonna be a really good bass. What do you think the average, like what, we've been catching them in 26 to 12 feet? Maybe yeah. a little deeper? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah eight, you're right. You're eight to twenty six. Eight to twenty six. Yeah. Pretty Those are the fish that you were probably catching. Yeah. <laughs> Suspended like that. Looks good. I mean, they're right down there in 12, 15 feet. So we are just working these jerk baits super slow. Five to ten second pauses, like really light taps and jerks. Every once in a while, just change it up. Yeah, that's what you're saying. Just every, I mean, you're changing. Oh, bottom. You're messing with how hard you're actually yeah. one, one ripping pause, it. Or one pop, two pop. Yeah. Some soft, some hard ones, some fast ones, some slow ones. Been kind of a weird day. Like, we're catching fish and then we'll go into a little lull and then we'll catch them again and then it slows down. Which might just be some of those feeding windows. Could be. Yeah. Got a lot of bait right here. All right, last cast right here. A very long bomb cast. Yeah, it went down. And I try to drop this bait right in his face. I don't know if he's down there still. Oh, got him. Oh, I had him, I think. Maybe I didn't, I was just wishful thinking. No, the bait's fouled up. It just got me excited. Oh, I did have him. <laughs> uh, Look at that last cast fish. It's a bluegill. It is. That's a, it could be a white perch. <clears throat> mm, I think it's a bluegill. Or maybe it is a white. I don't know. You were hungry, buddy. Look at that. What a way to finish the day off. Five species. Yeah. Fun day. Well, it was quite the day, actually two days. Like I said at the beginning of this video, Alex and I were out Friday evening and then Saturday, like pretty much all day. I think we left the ramp around 10 and we fished until 4.30 and did really well. We caught five species. Alex just smoked fish all day long, which is awesome. And I caught two bass, a couple crappie, bluegill, catfish. It's been a bit of a struggle for me this year, but still good to see fish caught and big fish too. I mean, Friday he caught the one big one. We didn't have a scale, but it was probably six or very close to it. He caught a five, four, three pound smallmouth, a bunch of other good bass. We were basically just fishing jerk baits and silver buddies on break lines where we were finding bait. So that's what I would suggest you guys try doing. If you're finding bait kind of suspended or you're seeing a bunch of suspended fish near lakes or rivers, definitely give that a shot. I actually don't even think I was able to find a clip where I was talking about the exact color jerk bait he was throwing. I might have one clip of the color. I don't know the name of it, but I'll just pop it up real quick. Here, we'll see if this works. So if you guys know the name of that, just drop that down in the comment section below. And yeah, I don't know what's going to be happening this week because we've gotten about eight or nine inches of snow, which I hate snow. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do me a favor, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, just wanted to keep thanking you guys so much for supporting me for this 50 state trip. Going to leave that link for the GoFundMe down in the comment section below. Thanks again, guys. I'll catch you later. might be a foot of snow. <laughs>